So the next question is how many protons and neutrons are there in the following nuclei and there are a set of nuclei given to us. So before we solve into before we move into how to solve this let's see what the formula for a neutron and a proton or what do they actually mean. So here neutron meaning mass number minus atomic number. and protons meaning it is the atomic number itself so now we know what the formula of or what do proton and neutron mean let's move into calculating for each element here so let's see for the first one for carbon with a 13 isotope let's see what it is so here if you want to find the number of neutron this is mass number mass number is 13 minus atomic number is 6 when we simplify them you get 7 so number of neutron is going to be 7 whereas proton is just the atomic number atomic numbers what is written down so 6 so neutron count is 7 and proton is 6 for a carbon 13 isotope now the second one is oxygen you have oxygen here so neutron atomic number atomic mass is 16 minus 8 which is the atomic number this is going to give 8 and proton count is equal to atomic number 8 third one here is for magnesium so magnesium neutron is 24 minus 12 24 is the atomic mass 12 is the number this is 12 and proton is equal to 12 which is the atomic number itself. Now the next one is for ion 56 and 26. Now neutron is atomic mass minus the atomic number. This will be 30 and for proton is just the atomic number 26 and the last one is for strontium now for strontium count of neutron is 88 minus 38 which is equal to 50 proton count is just the atomic number so that is 38 so this way if you know what is the formula for proton and neutron from the given information it is easy for you to calculate each of the value provided you are able to identify which is the atomic mass which is the atomic number.